Hello, my good people, and of course, this is Fred from Africa. Now, those are watching me for the first time, guys, I request that you promote us by subscribing, comment, and share. Now, the former NC member, Mr. Carl, made a shocking announcement on Thursday, which I'm going to play for you the audio speech to listen to. He made an announcement to join the Economic Freedom Fighters. This news actually shocked many people, and many people never believed it. During the briefing, Mr. Carl and his party members, the Areta, remember Areta, is Mr. Carl's party that he formed, he formed last year. Now, he had his members and his followers to join the Red Barret and extended the call to other parties such as the PSC, Azapu, the Africanist Congress, and many more to come and join hand with the EFF forces. Okay, ahead of the 2024 general election. Now, if you're watching us for the first time, guys, I request that you promote us by subscribing, comment, and share because a lot more videos of Africa are on the way coming. Stay tuned to our channel. Please continue subscribing, support us, and if possible, you can share our videos to many people who have never heard about us. Thank you for watching us. Please, let's watch this speech of Mr. Carl's joining EFF party. Areta will therefore not register to participate in the upcoming elections and will join the EFF also in our capacity as individual members starting with me as I'm standing here today. That party is the economic Freedom Fighters, the EFF. Uh -huh. Under the capable leadership of the Commander-in-Chief, Comrade Julius Malema, of the EFF, and the capable leadership of his Central Command Team. I'm very happy to see at the back of the hall, as we were talking, the provincial and regional representatives and leadership of the EFF has walked in and are sitting. We welcome them. I'm very impressed with how the EFF does this. You know, when I engaged with the Commander-in-Chief and with the Deputy President, Comrade Floyd Shibambu, they said to me, we are not going to go for a lot of blitz and glitz. We want this announcement that you are making to have integrity. We are not Fikile Mbalula. <laughs> we do not run around dishing out t-shirts just like that and create the impression even amongst people who are not even members of the party. So the leadership of the EFF came today and they said to me, we are not going to bring a lot of t-shirts for us to dress and undress here in front of the cameras. We will in due course present t-shirts. But they said to me, we will bring you a cap to put on at the end of your media statement. So I'm waiting to put on that cap at the end of the media statement. So as you can hear, comrades, the National Working Board of Areta has therefore determined that we must execute this carefully political analysis and be true to our convictions and join the EFF. Areta will therefore not register to participate in the upcoming elections and will join the EFF also in our capacity as individual members, starting with me as I'm standing here today. <laughs> this means, and I know it may be a little bit painful for some of you because we've really become attached to this Areta logo. But for these elections, the Areta logo and colors will not be on display 
during the election campaign. And our members are urged to join the EFF to be integrated into its structures. And the EFF election organizational structures in order to master the most effective election campaign under the leadership and the logo of the EFF. The message and appeal to our members is clear. Look also wherever you are for the EFF branch in your ward and join. We are not joining because we can't join the EFF as a block or a faction. We are doing so as individuals, but coming from Areta. And we, of course, subject ourselves to its democratic processes and its constitution. We will, for purposes of this election, where we have to work day and night, join the ground forces of the EFF, and campaign without any personal expectations, except, and this should be more than enough, comrades, the ushering in of economic freedom for our people. <laughs> so, comrades, in order for this approach to be effective, there will be no half measures. The Areta membership will join the EFF and will become one united progressive left force. Only the EFF logo will appear on the ballot papers and campaign without any personal expectations, except, and this should be more than enough, comrades, the ushering in of economic freedom for our people. So, comrades, in order for this approach to be effective, there will be no half measures. The Areta membership will join the EFF and will become one united progressive left force. Only the EFF logo will appear on the ballot papers. And in line with the careful analysis that I've presented, there will thus be no confusion. And it's very important, comrades. This is for me the crux of the matter. Only the EFF logo as the representative of the left progressive forces for radical economic transformation will be on the ballot paper. Of course, this is in line with our analysis that I've just presented. Thus, we will not contribute to any confusion. And the South African voter will be given a clear, unequivocal opportunity to vote for the EFF and for the revolutionary progressive policy program that it represents. That program is clearly set out in the founding manifesto of the EFF and the seven cardinal pillars of the economic freedom, which we fully embrace and support. Go and listen, read out to yourself the 10-point plan of Areta. Put this seven pillars next to it and understand. It's okay, comrade, don't try to add it now. And understand that there is no difference we are together.